Hello everyone, my name is Abdullah Nahyan and welcome to my channel code with Abdullah Nahyan. Today I am going to show you how to make an awesome and attractive contact art page using Elementor Page Builder and WebBridge add-ons. In this tutorial, I will use full full resource, um, uh, that means we don't need to buy any themes or plugin and fully without code. So we don't need any coding knowledge to make this contact page and you can make very easily using drag and drop. So first check our demo site. So we have basically two columns. At the left side, we have a contact info like contact title, view description, then like address email phone number and at the bottom we have a social icons and at the right side we have a contact info so user can easily uh, contact with site owner or administrator so basically this is our, our demo so let's, let's start work so for start work i already installed uh, wordpress in my local host and it's fully blank uh, i don't uh, install any theme and plugin yet so we can show step by step First, go to Appearance and Themes. Click Add New. And we chose here Hello Elementor. This is uh, Elementor Page Builder uh, basic theme. So just click on Install. And click on Activate. And basically, hello theme dependent on Elementor page builder. So we must need to install this uh, uh, plugin. So just click on install Elementor and it will be downloaded for WordPress.org official site. And it will down here. Just check here this link. This is official Elementor plugin. Uh, it takes few moments, depend on your internet speed. And click on activate plugin. Okay, fine. And now we need add a plugin so go to add new plugin and just search here web bricks and we can find this plugin here here this is this plugin so just click on uh, install now and this is compared with your version of wordpress that's fine just click on install now okay and click on activate it that's fine and from here we have done one settings go to settings part and add bounced and we need to load google uh for for support yes and click save changes that's fine now go to pages and click add new page like we can write this page title contact page click on publish edit with elementor Okay, from settings part, uh, we can choose here page layout to Elementor Canvas. And here, just click on plus icon and add equal to columns. And from here, we can choose uh, error icon center. And from advanced, we can add padding like top 50, bottom 50. That's fine. Now, click on this icon and we can search here like contact. And we have two uh, uh, add-ons from Webbricks uh, widget. Uh, one is contact info and other is cutoff 7. So just drag this contact info widget here. Okay, that's fine. And from here, we can drop uh, again size like contact form 7 and drag here. So this show a message. That means contact 7 is not installed here. So just click to install or activate contact for 7 just click here it's open new tab and here contact for 7 this one just click on install now and click activate remove this page and here click on first update and refresh the page Okay, just click here and we have an option, uh, select contact form, we have one option, voice form come, so go to here dashboard again, and here we have option contact form, and just click on contact form, by default we have one form, and this form is showcased here, if we add more form, everything will here uh, showcase in, in drop down, so just click on contact one, and this is our show here, okay fine. 
now we need to design part so first click on contact info and uh, we have three tabs content style advanced from content we have heading that's when we can change text from here like content one if you want this text just write something text change here that's very nice at the bottom we have infos this means this part uh, this is repeater part if you want more items just click on add item add one if you add more add the one will focus here and those are unlimited you can add so i can remove to this and uh, currently three is enough i think and if you want to modify this part just click on icon you can change icon from here if you want to change text you can change text from here if you want to add uh, anything you can wish and then we have a last social parts and social parts mean first title that means this follows if you change here it will be changed here okay and here we can just write here like social icon you can change icon here and this link that means you are like youtube youtube link if you have twitter twitter link if you have linkedin linkedin link as you wish interesting fact you can change uh, individual icon color from here so just like youtube and we can choose like red type color okay then we can choose for twitter uh, like this color for demo purpose for linkedin and here facebook uh, we can choose like something like this for example and here current color is not show because you have to update and click preview then we can change this yes that's fine and here we can change this here uh, i think uh, from content we can only contact is nice go to style and title that's with this title you can change color from here so we can just write zero zero eight zero eight zero okay till color then uh, i can copy this color from here and then text color so we can change text color from here then typography typography means uh, like font size font family line height text transform uh, letter spacing word spacing everything can change from here so we can choose here enter font click on enter okay like font size 40 pixel uh, font to add like 700 as you wish no problem you can change everything here then this is for description part this part so we can change color to like hash triple three typography we can change to font to enter font and here you can change everything from here okay this is the description part and if you have uh, like title color typography description color then we have info info that means this part so from here we can change icon color this global color okay this title that means this line so we can choose color to like hash triple three then we have typography we can change from here just right here enter and click on enter font that's fine if you want font size just like 500 and as you wish then we have a social icons so first heading this means this follow us text so we can change color to our primary color typography we can choose to here uh, enter font enter and font weight like 600 and font size like 22 pixel 26 okay uh, icon color if you don't want different color so you can choose a uh, global color from here so we want to different color so we don't change this color and finally this title so just change to color to hash triple three typography entire font like font weight 500 that's fine so all this part is done so click on say update and check boom that's very nicely done now we have our second part this is contra for seven so just click here and go to style so we have a lot of options if you want to alignment so it will be uh, center left or right so you can choose left side this is level part this meant your name your email subject your message etc called level so first change our typography so we can choose here like inter font okay uh, font size like 18 pixel 20 uh, 18 font weight like 500 okay text transform capitalize 
and which color they use okay black color okay fine then color we can choose like hash triple three placeholder if you have any placeholder you can change color currently we don't have any placeholder here that is spacing first i unlink this value so top like 10 and bottom spacing like 20 this for example now form style that means inner uh, box so input border color so you can choose like hash triple d okay uh input background if you want to change color background background change so you don't need color or we can different color like hash f4 f4 uh, or you can choose okay currently uh is better input focus when you click here this color so we want to choose this color okay that's fine then we have border address we can choose current all for 12 pixel okay if you want to change width you can change width from here so we can choose here uh, percentage and 100 percent perfect if you want input height you can change height from here so we can uh, like 35 then text area height we can choose height from here then like uh, 100 okay fine and finally we have button part so first button color we can change to like white color background we can choose our primary color typography we can choose here entire font and like 18 pixel font to 500 that's fine border ideas we can choose 12 pixel uh, padding we can choose top 10 bottom 10 right 30 left 30 okay and margin we can choose only this value that's fine border color we can remain same color uh, if you want to uh, uh, sorry this color okay if you want to change width you can increase manually width here like i think 180 is perfect that's fine and now hover effect so we can choose hover effect to white color and border color we can place this color and like this color something dark color and hover background color okay fine that's very nicely done click on update and check here so our site is perfectly done now so hopefully you enjoy this video and you can be easily very easily make how to make a uh, awesome contact page using web base arrows if you like this video don't forget to share and subscribe thank you very much for watching